Ever looking for a nice place to stay in Manila? Today we are covering two of my favorite five-star hotels that we have stayed in and we will be going over the prices, features, and quality of each hotel. The hotels we'll be covering are Crown Plaza in Quezon and Sofitel in Pasay. Alright, let's get to it. So Crown Plaza Galleria is just located at the heart of Metro Manila. It is a four-star hotel that offers superior comfort, a functional base for corporate activities, and the best conferencing venue for any meetings, incentives, and exhibitions, as stated on their website. So one of the featured amenities are a parking lot, a swimming pool, a gym, restaurant, and Wi-Fi included. And what's even cool is that you're right beside a mall called Robinson's Galleria, which is just interconnected with the hotel. All right, guys, so this is our room in Crown Plaza. So you've got your kettle there, coffee maker, and water bottles, as well as your cups, of course. And in here is the washroom. Ooh, look at this bathtub. What? We also get another bathtub? That's sick. Oh, and there's me. But that's not the main part of the tour, so let's keep going. There we go. So now with the lights turned on, let's just um, adjust the brightness a little bit here. This is what the bathroom looks like in all of its glory. TV. And of course, we get the two beds. Looks very comfortable on your back. Got a lamp right there. Let's check what's outside. You get the beautiful view of Kazan City. And you can just see the cars right there. Oh, something's under construction right now. Also, in this hotel, you get buffet breakfast as well, which is really convenient. If you're really hungry in the morning, you can just go ahead and eat. So there you go. And here's like a little 360 shot, 360 view. Very nice hotel. So we are in the fifth floor and we're about to check the pool, which is right behind me right there. Okay, so this is the courtyard. Very nice. It's like, ooh, you can even look at the towers right there. Wow. So you're surrounded by plants and this modern aesthetic of the courtyard. I can imagine how beautiful it would look at night too all the lights open and now for the good part the swimming pool just pretty big and you can see the towers up in there as well beautiful I've only been here for like a few hours and I'm already loving this hotel you've got everything you pretty much need and as a point of reference, that is $250 per night. That is equivalent to 10,815 pesos here in the Philippines. And exchange rates change all the time. And also in the third floor, you get a direct access to the mall because there's a tunnel going through. So we're going into Robinson's, Robinson's Galleria right now which is connected to our hotel. And I think there are only two floors, or no, I was wrong. There are one, two, three floors. So there's a lot to check here. This is pretty convenient because if you want to go shopping without having to like use a taxi or drive all the way to the mall, this is a place for you because uh, you got pretty much everything you need. And this part's even nicer because you even get a fourth floor at the top. I thought there were only three floors, but there's four actually. There are four floors. Wait, what is this? Guys, this is creepy. Anyways, this mall's way bigger than I thought it would be. Holy. I am shocked because there is literally a ghost playing the piano right now. I'm, I'm scared. I think this mall is haunted, guys. No. 
All right, guys, this is pretty cool because they're creating their own robot. So this is like a robotics race right here. This is amazing because like they're using their own creativity and knowledge to build their own robots and put it to the test with the race right there. Where's Lats? Wait, yeah, where am I? Guys, my parents are looking for me and I don't know where I am either. Mom, where's Lance? There you go. Wait, guys, where am I? I don't know where I am. So we are in a bar called Seven Corners right now. All right, guys, so this is dining room area where you get your breakfast for free. It's really modern, really sleek. You get a lot of options to choose from if you're about to eat. right here hopefully my tripod doesn't fall out so this pool is about four feet deep and um, what's cool is that you get the beautiful background here like I mentioned earlier um, the plants are here like um, the buildings you can look at the tall skyscrapers all day I know my uh, tripod's gonna fall but here it is get seats and an umbrella and a table in case you want to rest what's pretty cool is that in case you want to go to the gym it's right at the back right there, if you see that door. This hotel is divided into two towers. So that right there is another district of the hotel, as well as um, the one we're sleeping in right there. Overall, I really had a fun time here in Crown Plaza Galleria in Kazan City. I generally enjoyed their free breakfast service, and they had a pretty nice swimming pool. And I enjoyed my time working out in the gym as well. The bed was very comfortable and I had no problems with it. So if you're looking for a good hotel to sleep in with a decent shopping experience, then Crown Plaza may be for you. For the price, it's definitely not a bad deal at all. But if you're looking for a 5 star hotel that offers everything you need, keep watching. Our second hotel is at Sofitel. So in case you don't know, Sofitel is a chain of luxury hotels based in France. And they have over 120 locations. Manila is no exception here. Being a 5-star hotel, what are some of the features you may ask? Well, there are quite a lot to name here. One thing the hotel is known for is the spiral buffet, a huge swimming pool and a bar, a stage for meetings and banquets, huge family bedrooms, and that is just a few out of the hundred features there are in this hotel. So there's a fashion store right there, actually no, three of them, jewelry, dresses, you know, pottery, so this is the lobby, and then here's the entrance, once again, there's a huge dining area with waterfalls there to add a nice touch. So starting off with, oh, there's me. Um, so yeah, this is the living room. Excuse the dirty table, I'm just gonna, perfect. Okay, so it's clear, oh, dad's cheering. Dad, what's outside? What's in the balcony? Okay. So look at that, beautiful view of Manila, Manila Bay. Then we get a good view of um, Manila right here. Perfect. Okay, now let's go back inside. Oh yeah, here's our room, our dining room, our TV, 
And also here's the design of the other room, like the wall design. So when we go inside over here, we get a cool little master bedroom for my parents. Um, yeah, and we get another TV right here and a studying desk, pretty nice. And I haven't checked the washroom yet, so I'm just gonna open it real quick. Awesome, so they actually have two sinks right here. And of course we get bathtub, another bathtub right there. Below the counter, it also lights up, so that's pretty cool, that's pretty neat. Here's the mirror view, light. I would also like to take the time to talk about the spiral buffet here. So the restaurant is divided into 21 different dining ateliers, each having their own delicacies and beverages. And the food court has its own schedule where it is open for breakfast, lunch, and dinner. And what's also cool is that you'll find an acoustic band playing in the stairs. Okay, so what's cool is how the kids' pool extends all the way from here to there, to the bar. And there's a little bridge here, let's cross it. There's the other side. Then, they call it the lazy pool, which is pretty cool, especially when, um, you know, you can swim from one side to the other. There's the bar. Oh wow, so you actually can get drinks while you're swimming. That's pretty cool. Bar at the back, swimming pool. This, and here's the view from the back side. And yes, the tree's blocking it. So I'm gonna move here. Okay, let's check what's in here. Also, um, there's a little deck here. Don't know what to say. Remember when I said Crown Plaza was the best hotel I've been to? That was until Sofitel blew my mind. Unfortunately, I wasn't able to mention all of the features such as the spa and the luxury room for meetings and weddings. But overall, I would say this hotel is so worth it. And if you're wondering about the prices, here it is. You literally have the view of Manila Bay, which is pretty near to SM Mall of Asia. And as much as I sound biased for this, I would rate this hotel a 10 out of 10, hands down. The beds are perfectly comfortable. You get a wide variety of food to choose from, from the spiral buffet. The swimming pool and the bar are so much fun to stay around in. I'm just speechless, like, I don't know what else to say. So now we come to the conclusion. Which one should I go for, Crown Plaza or Sofitel? The answer is quite complicated because one is a 4-star hotel and the other is a 5-star. But here's my take. 
if you don't need all of the fancy features such as the big swimming pool or the spiral buffet, but you want a mall that is right beside you, which comes with better ease of access, then Crown Plaza may just be for you. However, if you're wanting to live the life of luxury, and you don't mind spending the extra cash for all the bells and whistles a 5-star hotel offers, then Sofitel is pretty much right here on the table. But what do you guys think? Do you prefer Crown Plaza or Sofitel? Let me know in the comments because I'm interested to hear what you guys think. And I really hope you enjoyed this video. I know it's not the typical hotel review where I put a bit of vlogs in the mix. But if you have suggestions that you want to throw in, feel free to comment down below since I'm interested to hear what you guys think. Anyways, that does it for this video and a subscribe to the channel would be greatly appreciated so you'll be notified to when I upload the finale of the Philippines travel series. Thank you guys once again and I'll see you next time. So this, my friend, is the outdoor area. Okay, so um, let's go one by one, take a little tour. And yes, I am filming with my Nikon camera because I'm out of space for my phone. Yeah. Here's the kids pool, waterfall right now. Everyone's just having a good time, huh? So this is also common in Canada, where I live. We have food trucks right there, here and there. I'm not sure what they serve, so let's check it out as we walk through. And of course, fake grass meets real grass again. Okay, this one's closed right now. They're both closed, but... Um, they possibly have burgers and rice bowl, but... Okay, so they offer burgers and... Power bowls, cool. Yeah. It's not. They're open only on week uh, weekends. Yeah. So, okay, it's kind of way too zoomed in. So the hotel spans all the way from here to here. So we reach the food truck section. So right there is um, the tennis, like the tennis court and the sports area. 